Have you ever been deceived? My name's Gregory Hamilton, and I've been deceived a bazillion times. I mean, I can't even count and tell you how many times I've been deceived. Sometimes because I'm just ignorant and naive and uh, gullible. And sometimes because others had actually their intentions were to deceive me. And I didn't realize it and just went along and fell for it. I, uh, my name is Gregory Hamilton, but I bet you that you could put your name in that exact same sentence and say the same thing. I, fill in the blank, have been deceived in my past. If you haven't been deceived in your past, you really need to open up your eyes. We've all been deceived. By people we know and by strangers, by our TV news sources, and by uh, our, uh, our own self going and looking for information in the wrong places, okay? And if you can't understand the fact that you've been deceived in the past, and if you can't understand the fact that you've been deceived in the present, then you will always be deceived in the future. It's about learning. The deceivement is there for your learning purposes. How else would you learn? Look at this right now. I can use trickery and say there's a mirror going through here, right? Look at, but we can, we know that box is a box, but look, just smoke and mirrors. You see what I mean? Deceptions can be very easily done. It's just a battery, wires, and then when I clean all this up and make it so you don't see any of this, magic. But we know that it's just deceptions. So, we don't get down on ourselves when we've been deceived. We learn from it. If you have seen my YouTube, or excuse me, my Twitter history, you will see that I've that there was a point in time about a year ago, maybe a year and a half ago, where I understood that I was in a cult. I was not allowed to think differently than everybody else. And the second I challenged the thought process of everybody else, I was excommunicated from a community. Because I thought on my own and didn't Blindly trust the plan. I was kicked out of this cult community two years ago. I was ridiculed. And I stuck around and kept showing exactly how the cult works. So that when the time came like this, now, I could still be a beacon and show how to expose how witchcraft works. And one of the ways to expose witchcraft is by just challenging the most simplest question. Where are you getting your information from? Will you share that information with others? And of course, I'm just trying to fill in the blanks now to act smart instead of letting it flow. But if you question authority and they excommunicate you, you're in a cult. Maybe governments can be run that way. I don't know. But I do know mind control works that way. And so does propaganda. 
So every time that you fall for someone's trick, man, the devils, the governments, whoever's, if it's your first time, ouch, it hurts. If it's someone like me that's fallen for every single trick in the book, every single conspiracy theory you can think of, I've fallen for. I'm a master at falling for deception. Therefore, I was able to spot it, call it out, shine the light on it, and will be here until I am no longer here to expose how witchcraft works. God bless America. God bless Jesus Christ. And God bless you.